Where this building is today, a black-owned restaurant once stood on the beach, and this is the man that owned it, Johnny Walker. It was one of the few places in Sussex County uh, where people from all areas could come and enjoy it. Previously called Beach 2, this beach is now named in Walker's honor. Today we got to hear the stories of folks who were kids here and just hear about how he served great burgers and fries and how he hired young people to be lifeguards. Johnny Walker was a pillar of the black community in Lewis, and this beach was the only one open to all races during times of segregation. People had a place to go. Black people had a place to go that they could call their own and, and, and enjoy the beach just like anyone else. And, and be safe. It, and be safe. Many gathered to celebrate and spread awareness of the history of the beach for the black community. There are people who don't look like us who are here to learn. The mayor came, the former mayor, people from the community, and their supporters. So the message gets spread wide and far beyond us. And the goal of this event is to never forget the black history in Lewis and what's to come. The black community has been a historic part of this area, a part of what has built up the town and a part of what has supported the community and the commerce here. Keeping that history alive and, and one thing is, is to be proud of it, right? Because it's, it's here, it's still here and we want it to thrive and really continue and just be that beacon of light here in this area. The organizers of this event hope to expand this beach to more than just a sign, but to add more signs to talk about the history of this beach and Johnny Walker for future walking tours. In Lewis, I'm Carmen Holland, 